Packers at Colts. And really, this is one of the best games of the weekend in my mind. I think it's America's game of the week, but I'm not sure because I don't really follow that. Uh, the Packers have Aaron Rodgers in a pretty great offense, but the Colts have arguably the best defense. I don't know. I think the Bears defense is pretty good, and I think the Dolphins defense is pretty good, but I think this is a top three defensive unit by Indy. They've been phenomenal, doing everything from stopping the run to stopping the pass. They've been great ever since the beginning of the year when they had that weird game against Jacksonville. I feel like Jacksonville hasn't won a game since then. <laughs> the Colts have been pretty great since, only losing two games, one to the Browns. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, but the Packers are a great football team, a team that I think can compete for a Super Bowl this year. I was wrong on the Packers this year. I'm sorry, Aaron Rodgers is still a good quarterback. I'm still hoping that my playoff predictions work out. I'm going to be rooting for the Bears and the Lions over the next few weeks to get to the playoffs, but I don't know if that's a likely possibility. But I really like Indy here. The defense has been fantastic. The Packers, the Packers offense versus the Colts defense is going to be the thing to watch this game. It's going to be fantastic football to watch. Now, another underrated thing I'm looking forward to is the Colts offense versus the Packers defense. The Colts offense isn't known for its productivity, but neither is Packers defense. So that makes just an interesting thing to watch. Indy has had a great games. I think a ground, a Jonathan Taylor is a really good back, and I'm excited to see if he has a breakout game against this pretty bad Packers defense. So give me the Colts to win in this one. They're favored by one and a half, and I like that. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,